Hi, I'm Jill Galloway. I'm an artist educator at the Smithsonian's National Portrait Gallery. In today's open studio lesson, we're focusing on a portrait of Eunice Kennedy Shriver. And then based on that portrait, I've taken out one of the elements and we're gonna create an art project based on that. We're gonna use tissue papers today and a lot of glue. This will be fun, let's get started. The supplies you'll need for today's lesson are tissue papers in rainbow colors, a piece of white cardstock or thick paper, and some glue. This is an oil painting in the photorealism style. Photorealism means it's painted with such great detail it looks just like a photograph. This is a group portrait. Can you tell which sitter is the main subject? And if yes, how do you know? Eunice Kennedy Shriver is standing here on the beach among children and adults who have all benefited from her efforts. Shriver is the driving force behind the creation of the Special Olympics. In 1957, she established a summer day camp at her home in Cape Cod, which you can see in the distant background of this painting. What started out as a summer camp has now grown to include more than 1.3 million children and adults from more than 180 countries. Take a look at the sky in this portrait. What you see here is a rare moon halo. These occur when millions of tiny ice crystals and thin clouds reflect the sun's light bouncing off the moon. You have to be standing in exactly the right spot and looking up in order for the halo to appear. So today we're making rainbows with tissue paper and a glue wash. To make a glue wash, pour some glue into a little cup or a tin, and then add twice as much water as glue. So that's two to one, and then mix it up. You can draw a rainbow, or you can just make a loose paper rainbow. It doesn't really matter, just have fun with these colors. With your finger or a paintbrush, put a layer of glue wash down on the paper and then place torn pieces of tissue paper over top. You can add more glue over the tissue paper or pull the pieces of tissue paper up using just the stain for your design. The artist David Lenz was commissioned to paint this portrait as part of the first prize for winning the Atwin Bucci for Portrait Competition. Lenz won the competition with a portrait of his son Sam, who has actively participated in the Special Olympics. This portrait is the first portrait commissioned by the National Portrait Gallery of a person who is not the president or the first lady. When it was installed, Mrs. Shriver came to see the portrait. There's so many fun ways to use tissue paper and glue washes to make all different kinds of art projects. I would suggest just experiment and have a lot of fun. Thanks again for joining me and we'll see you next time.